Hi everybody, how are you? It's Dr. Swickle, functional podiatrist, human movement specialist, and founder of Naboso. So anyone who follows my work knows that I love sensory stimulation, and I'm fascinated by the concept of body perception, body awareness, as it relates to both internal and external awareness. Today, we're going to speak about a word that is called gravis sensing. This is a really cool word that I came across when I was doing some research for my upcoming book, which is called Sensory Sapiens. Stay tuned. So gravis sensing is, as the word says, your ability to sense gravity. Through our nervous system, we are able to perceive the sensory stimulation of gravity. Now, why I'm fascinated with gravity is that it's the only constant in this world. Gravity is this weight that's sitting on our shoulders, or as our foot strikes the ground, it is the vibration of that foot ground contact. So your ability to perceive gravity weight is through your proprioceptive system, and then that helps you to connect to where your body is in space. Some people will refer to this as kinesthetic awareness. Now, body awareness, gravis sensing can be done from both a global perspective, which means your whole body wears it in space, but it could also be joint specific. Total body specific is if you're trying to walk across a balance beam or a tightrope and you wanna know how your body is controlling its center of gravity. A local example would be, let's say you wanna prevent getting an ankle sprain. So you are about to step off of a curb and you're sensing how quickly that joint is shifting so that you could control it and prevent an ankle sprain. Now, the way that you build both global and local body awareness, joint awareness, gravis sensing is through a few cool tips and tricks. Are you ready? Your first one to increase your gravis sensing perception and body awareness is going to be using weights, not a dumbbell weight, but a wrist weight. So using wrist weights stimulates and increases your joint proprioceptors and your perception of where your arm limb is in space. You can also use a weighted vest. So I will use weighted vests and wrist weights with a lot of my movement disorder patients. So this could be someone who had a stroke, dys, uh, dystonia, Parkinson's, MS, things like that. And you're helping to feel where their body is. So if I am reaching for something or I'm taking a step, I will have a heightened awareness if there is a weight on that limb because it stimulates more proprioceptors or my ability to grab a sense. My second tip is to use compression. So compression is a great way to help you to connect to your body. You feel your body. So that compression element, this could be a compressive sleeve. This could be compressive apparel. So there's a lot of compressive garments that are on the market now. Uh, some of the research is a little bit skewed as far as the efficacy for maybe some recovery and things like that. But I like compression for body awareness, joint awareness. So let's say I have um, something going on with my elbow and I use a compressive sleeve, an arm sleeve that crosses that joint, that connection helps me to feel and perceive that joint locally or that local gravis sensing perception. My third and final way is going to be getting out of your shoes. Of course, you knew I was gonna say this. Getting barefoot, wearing minimal shoes, or of course, using the Naboso textured insoles. So your ability to feel foot ground connections is another powerful gravitational relationship. As I wrap up, please remember that gravity is weight. Weight is perceived by your body through the proprioceptive system. It is done globally. Where is your center of gravity, which is your core? A little bit lower, but it's around your center. And then it's also around joints. So joint position sense. The way that you perceive gravity as it relates to the ground is going to be ground reaction forces, which is going to be vibrations. So we need to feel the floor. We need to feel the ground, where we're stepping, how hard we're stepping. We need to feel our body in space. And all of that is used by your nervous system to paint this beautiful picture, to control dynamic movement, and to do some of the really cool shit that we see athletes do is based off of their ability to grab a sense. To learn more, you can head to ebfaglobal.com or check out my practice, which is dremilyspickle.com. Stay barefoot strong. Till next time.